Hi, my name is Santiago and I'm gonna give you some advices to improve uh, your English or my English because in this process we both learn so or we both are learning so uh, one of the things that I've learned in the past quarter is that if you don't catch up a word, if you don't grab a word at the first time, um, maybe you should repeat it, repeat it, repeat it until you catch it and until you understand it. Uh, I think that's the most important one. That's why I I bring it up uh, first. Um, if you don't catch a word, a phrase, or even a, a complete sentence, uh, the most recommended thing or the, the thing that I recommend you the most is to repeat it and when you repeat it and until you understand it um, that's the the correct way or the correct path so it sticks to your head it sticks in your mind and with the pass of time uh, you're gonna comprehend it and you're gonna be able to uh, improve your English and maybe even talk with some native American speakers, maybe some native British speakers. And I think that's the goal um, we're seeking everyone that uh, is practicing English. And I think that's a, a very cute goal, a very pretty goal and a very respectable uh, goal uh, to speak, to be able to speak another language and to be able to be understandable to others that are speaking the, uh, that language. In this case, English, uh, obviously there are many and flavorful, uh, many accents uh, like British, American, even African English accent. And you know, uh, I think that the most complicated one it's British English because they talk really, really fast. I don't, I mean, I, at this point, I, I, I'm not able to, I can't, I can't catch the words. I can't grab them because they talk so fast and they, they, they drag some words, some sentences, uh, like in the activity, the Beatles, the long and windy road, uh they dragged so much words uh, it was like they were talking their own language <laughs> it was pretty funny although i did it i tried to did it uh, the right way i tried at least i tried because um i mean that's another way to to improve your english uh, to try to keep trying and, and practicing uh, you can also write uh, in in a paper in your book um, some words that you don't understand and maybe record yourself watching a video of yourself uh, speaking that language that's another way to improve your your English or an, or even another language that you're practicing or studying um, I think that's another way to practice and improve your English. I think uh, another way to improve your English, another tip, another hack is that um, maybe you need to uh, start studying a, a dictionary, an English dictionary. And, and I think uh, that's it. Um, so, the most important one is keep practicing, keep trying. Don't don't ever give up, because that that's the point where <laughs> that's the point where almost everybody um, left, and that's the point where everybody that's in uh, starts winning. So um, I guess it's not that uh, big of a deal. Uh, to to a lot of persons, but if you speak another language, and in this case, 
a big one and the first one the most speaking uh, speak in in the whole world is english so if you learn it uh, you're gonna have an advantage uh, over your competitors thank you